It's in jail. What's up, everybody? All right. Have you ever wondered how a festival is created in Vietnam? Let me show you. This is a festival, and it's kind of an interesting festival. It's a book and island festival. So we're going to kind of walk around it, and I'm going to talk about... Uh, it's very interesting, actually, what, what, what this is uh, about. Um, let's go this way. They're testing music over there. I'm playing work, 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 work. Don't nobody want to work, 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 work. <sighs> so, let me get my notes. I've been running around. So, it's for the Spratly Islands and the Parcel Islands that belong to Vietnam. That has been contested by the CCP. They even went to war over it two times. Uh, yeah, it's theirs. And the CCP constantly tries to claim it as theirs. This is the longitude, longitude lines for the islands. And yeah, they're proud that they own these two islands. So that's what they're, uh, that's what this is for. And it's also works as a book festival too. But this is to commemorate and celebrate uh, them having the two islands and not the CCP. You know how the great CCP is. You try to take shit from everybody. So yeah, this is kind of a behind the scenes look on how did these festivals are created? It's actually pretty amazing the way that they do this stuff. I think they started building this one about two days back. I'm not gonna be here for the main festival, so that's why we're getting the behind the scenes video. We will be in Hanoi this weekend. I will be holding a stream tomorrow for the flight and hotel. So we'll be doing that tomorrow. Maybe just a stream at home, you know, just chatting with you guys, try to raise a hundred bucks or so few hundred bucks to just cover the flights and the hotel so yeah they're testing stuff here too hopefully they don't play a song but yeah they literally set up like a little village inside of these places it's it's quite interesting a couple of hotties not bad See? thumbnail i think so i think so i think we got that thumbnail so yeah they set up all these little things and these are all temporary and then they'll they'll take it all down it's a lot of uh aluminum rods like this so it's all on these like aluminum rod and they build up like this whole thing will be built into like a little city oh here's some some advertising for whatever company's helping to uh sponsor this festival um um Balini? i don't know what that is i'll ask the wife she'll know como ebooks so i think it's all book stuff so to get the funding for this, that you know they've got to partner up with people and things. So, yeah, this is like uh, the audio book, the Amazon of books in uh, Vietnam, Como. <laughs> pretty cool. They did a pretty good job so far. So yeah, this is how it all is, and you'll see people in meetings right now. So they're discussing like performances, what's going to be said. They'll do walkthroughs. So they get it set up almost fully set up about two days before it goes so that they can uh, essentially come through here and then have practice, you know, practice sessions for the performers. Another thing we are seeing is tourists. I've seen a shit ton of tourists today. It's happening. So it's finally the tourists are, are coming in. I saw huge groups of tourists. I could see almost all of them look like they've come from Thailand because they all got the Thai gear on, you know, like the Thai the Thai shorts and Thai shirt and Thai dress that you buy at the markets there. We have the same ones here in, in uh, Vietnam. A couple, of, couple of hoodies over here. A couple of hoodies. Nothing wrong with that. That always helps with thumbnail. Performer. So they're going to start doing practice performances to be ready for whatever their performance is going to be. Probably some kind of dancing. These guys are dialing in the uh, sound. And you'll see, I'll show you some more meetings over here. It's gonna be a short video, about 10 minutes. Straight to the point. So yeah, they're very proud that they continue to own these islands that China has continuously tried to claim as theirs, well, the CCP. So that's really what this is, is a celebration that, uh, Vietnam has them. Let me see. I got some more information on that. Give me a second here. 
Hong Sai, Tong Sai Island, Vietnam and China fight for the two islands for many years. So, it belongs to Vietnam. I, this is all stuff from the wife. She's like, we have these islands, not the CCP. And I'm sure the CCP says the same vice versa crap, you know. They love propaganda. That is a, a tool. There's two tourists right in front of us. Total tourists. And most of the tourists I've met have, have come from like Bali, Thailand, um, from like local Southeast Asia fairs, essentially. So they'll have like a VIP section for all these festivals. That's what I think we're looking at uh, right here. Yeah, you can tell by the chairs, the like white chairs with the ribbon. Yeah. The fancy chairs, I like to call them. Yeah, there's probably a VIP section. I don't know how that works. I think they just give it away. Yeah, some big screen, big LED panel on there. I think, I don't know what's in these. Maybe gasoline for the Jennies. And what do we got over here? It's a shame I can't come film the festival regular, but this is just as good. I thought it'd be kind of neat to go over, you know, how they actually create these festivals. It looks like this one might open tomorrow. Actually, they already got the books out. Yeah, I think maybe this one's gonna be a, a week longer. I mean, you can see, you can see all the book stuff in here. Yeah. Books, 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 books. Let's walk around towards the other side. Gotta take Winnie to class. I'm on a tight deadline. Today has been extremely busy. Uh, a guy tried to meet me at the orphanage, but the orphanage address, it's hard to find. And I'm on such a tight schedule, I couldn't wait for him to find it. So I ended up filming it and then going from the orphanage straight to here to film this. Then I gotta take Winnie to work. So extremely busy day. Oh, people are already shopping for books. So it's kind of half open. It's kind of cool. Let's take a look in here. Yeah, it's like half open already. I think I filmed the book festival before. I don't know. I filmed so many things. All kinds of books. All the books. I wonder if they have any manga. Manga. When he's reading Conan again. They got new ones out. Let's see if 100's out. I think 99's the last one she read. Graphic novels, toys, not seeing manga. We'll find it. We'll find it. Conan. Hold on, let me send her. Conan. Hold on. Uh, let me take a picture. And the toys. Yeah, I think we filmed it. And then, of course, you've got the pinnacle main stage. Looks like Oppo has something going on down here. Conan 99, 98. That's only 99, 98, so. What Dragon Quest, huh? <laughs> Brings back some nostalgia. Oh, the manga. So here's the pinnacle main stage here. Pretty cool, man. They did a good job on this. They're getting better and better each year with these, man. They just continue to improve over time. It's pretty awesome. Well, let's see what Oppo's doing down here. What's Big Brother Oppo doing? So this is how these festivals are made. You're seeing a, a literal behind the scenes right now. This guy's doing wiring. It's a big deal. I mean, it takes teams of 
you know, 100, 200 people here setting all this stuff up. And, and this stuff all gets set up from scratch each time. I saw them out measuring a week or two ago, so I knew there was going to be a festival. Popo doesn't have any of their stuff out yet, but the, the tents are pretty prominent there. Looks like it's going to be a banger of a festival, to be honest with you. So definitely, if you're here, come check this out. I mean, there's not an incredible amount to do. It's just cool to come look at. Festivals are a big thing here. I still wish they had, you know, maybe some kind of food festival instead of just this type of stuff, but I don't think they're, uh, that's in their wheelhouse yet. Maybe in the years to come. But that looks great. They did a great job on the main stage. All right, guys. That is the building of the book festival on Win Way and the celebration of owning their two islands and not the CCP. I hope you guys enjoyed it. I've been busting my arse lately to provide good content and I'm working every day full on. You know, we're live streaming. I am extremely uh, busy. So to anyone that wants to hang out and if I don't get around to it, I apologize. If you're here for the long term though, don't worry, we'll, we'll hang out. It's a weird way to do a misting machine. It's got a weird smell to it too. But I think this festival starts tomorrow. All right guys, thanks for watching. Stay frosty. See you in Vietnam. Peace out.